What's up everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Today, we're going to be reacting to... Some Led Zeppelin! I pulled this out because for uh, Dazed and Confused, let me remind you, it earned the glasses... Earn the guitar, the glasses from him, and the fire extinguisher. You can show a little clip of us rocking out on it. <clears throat> yeah, I'll, sh I'll show a clip yeah. right now. Here it is. Three, two, one. Bam. Oh, Hope you enjoyed that clip. Um, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. We're going to be bet. reacting to Babe, I'm Gonna Leave You because uh, apparently this is a really good song off the first album. The last two we did was off the first album. What were they? Dazed and Confused and what else? In my, what is it? In Days of My Youth? What's that song called? In the days of my youth. I was told what it means to be oh, a yeah. man. Yeah. I don't know the name of it, though. What's the name of it? Good times, bad times. Good I times, bad times. That was the name. All right, thank you. Look, and we asked you guys, should we do this? Do Zeppelin in chronological order? And and and, and, and you could show the, uh, what do you call it? The uh, survey. The voting poll. Yeah, look, check this out. Um, yeah, if you see one of these voting things... Go ahead and polls, uh, yeah. go have, ahead and we vote because uh, it's going to Let's see how it looking. There it is down 50 there. Fifty percent says in order. Yeah. All right. Good. All right. All right. Well, so we're and probably going to go in order for as long as we can. All right. So. I'm ready, babe. I'm going to leave you. So this is days and confused. All right. His woman messed his head from all down the below. way up. She from down below. She her soul was from down below. She messed him so, up so much. He forgot how to play the guitar and got a cello bow and started just playing on it. So now he held it up to his neck. Or what song, what number it is on the yeah, album? Yeah, because if this is after Days of Confuse, it makes sense. Because it you might sh be. Should be leaving her. It has to be after Days of Confuse, I would think. Yeah. Well, let's let's do it. All right. All right I'm ready. Here we go. Because, man, in the summertime, yeah, that's when everybody's out. That's when people... Yeah, you don't want to yeah. leave her in the winter because then... You got to leave in the summer. And and the way he says, babe, I'm going to leave you with such finality. Like, I... He got that shaky voice. I completely believe him. Like, he I'm had like, that shaky voice. He sounded like... Uh, he sounded real broken and tattered from he, that uh, he, girl. He's like, babe, I'm going to leave you babe, in the summertime. Why well, wait till the summertime? All right, let's go. Summer comes in Yes, I hear this. They, man. This could that acoustic. Playing. Do you hear that? 
the just the melody in the background, yes. how clear, crystal clear it is. I yes. feel like I'm in the room with him playing. Not is only this that, Jimmy Page playing the yeah, acoustic? It has to be. And it sounds so Western. It sounds so like for almost real. Spanish and Western. You know, and for that era, I don't hear no Beatles. I don't hear no I don't hear any. Well this is uh, sixty nine or sixty sixty eight. I don't, 68. 68. I don't like hear yeah, I don't hear any influence from other bands. They sound so original. And one of the things you guys said in in the comments um, was, you know, that that Jimmy Page founded this man and he gave himself plenty of time you know he's writing the songs he's giving himself the time he needs to show off his skills and that makes such a difference like with black sabbath you can hear that too with with, with tony that on guy, uh on itunes it says 1969 man bro that's what it says on itunes so. oh man so far the music the acoustics right here but it does sound like he layered it it sounds like he's playing it and then it sounds like he played it again and layered it together because i it, do you hear it? it sounds like he's playing over himself what the guitar? Yeah, it seems like I sometimes I hear it layered. I don't think it's just. Uh, I don't think they have a two guitars. It's just Jimmy. Yeah, well, All right, let's, let's keep, keep it going. going. I can hear it calling me the way it used to do. I can hear it calling me back That's two, like a layer. Man, it's like I'm being serenaded. This Do you song, hear this beautiful guitar playing? It sounds like a love song and it's a breakup song. Yes, man. I hear this beautiful guitar playing. Oh my playing. goodness, in both ears? I got different songs playing in both ears. How can this man play the guitar so good? And no, that's that's too. He's not doing that at the same time. There's no way. Yeah, he definitely played yeah. it and then went back and played another. Le- he's like, and they, and then he's they like, put that so second can, one in the in the left it. ear. They they put one yeah, in the yeah, right, yeah. one in the left. He's like, I mean, imagine how good the the, the just one layer of his acoustic sounds. And he's like, I think I can, I think I can improve it. And then he comes in and again, he just adds a little little extra on on it, a little top and so. How did he learn? That style, that like, who influenced this? Man, you know, it sounds like that. Um, it sounds like a, uh, like the uh, Western, like, like it sounds very Western. And the and Robert Plant, the singer, compliments, uh, Paige perfectly. His voice is so. Man, every time awesome. um Robert Plant starts like screaming, singing, because he's I like on, on I like the singing the best. Yeah, at sure. the beginning. At the very first words he says, he is screaming on yeah, Days of Confusion. He is. Like, he comes in at the top of his lungs. That's super, super soprano and, sound. And this one, he's doing it a little bit, and, too. Not and, as much as that Days of Confusion, but he's doing it. I did, and I do like how, if you really, the drummer is is really um, uh, driving a lot of the song. Like, the drummer goes up, and then he goes down, and then he goes up, and they're all following him. I hear the drummer coming in. The only person I really can't identify and vibe with right on this song yet is the bass player. Man, I, I know I, I can't I, I at can't the beginning. Find them. Man, at the beginning, it you has a serious bass at the beginning. Yeah. Maybe like, I was just overwhelmed by the other stuff. I mean, you know, first time reacting to it. So. I heard the bass at the beginning. You did? It was, it was, I, I didn't say nothing because I forgot after the acoustics came in and it started uh, killing yeah, it, yeah, but yeah, yeah. yeah, the bass at the beginning was killing it. 
Now I'm not hearing that much bass. I'm gonna listen for it. They drop it, pull it back, and let that acoustic come I'm in real nice for and it. quiet. All right, this song Let's is go. awesome. I know. I know I never, 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 never gonna leave you, babe. I gotta go away from this place. can't believe that that was their first album that sounded like the top why do you have to bring that up the top grammy performance i mean that just seems like any band that would be their best song ever and to led zeppelin it's like it's this far down the line and whenever they were doing when they when they were recording it man they didn't have to be that good they, they did not have to have that much that many different sounds in it to be a good song. It was a good song. It was a good song. Like with half of that would have been a great song. That's like they. That's like they remind me of Rush. They overproduce it to the point where it's a masterpiece. The, but for me, Robert Plant stole the song on this one. Man, he, when he comes in, whoever mixed it, they they turn his vocals up right when he's punching that baby, baby. Man, it overshadows the whole song. Like I, I think they could almost do an, just an all acoustic version, and he would just be killing it. I mean, and he was just twenty years old. They, he said they said all of them were like around twenty. I think Jimmy Page was just a little bit older, and that's why he was able to pull the band together. But when they were sitting around doing it, I mean, that sounded so different. I wonder if they were like, if they questioned if people were going to resonate with their music, because this is this is a lot different than music at that time. At least, what do you think in the con in the comment section? I mean, imagine if you bought this the 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 album the day the week it hit the 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 record uh, um, uh, stores. 
I mean, were, were, did you go home and turn this on and be like, you wasn't ready for a this? A new era of music has begun. Man, now, that's what I would be thinking. Yeah, I was. I, I, I would. I would. I would just be tripping on 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 this album. Man, that that song was awesome. Tell us what else on Led Zeppelin one specifically to uh to listen to on on in the comments because we want yeah. we're gonna stick with the album a little bit maybe we'll do i don't know two more songs i don't know how many more off of this one are highly recommended yeah uh, uh but this one was awesome and i would imagine man if you were if you were thinking about breaking up with your girlfriend well this is the anthem right here this song I, I right still here. don't know. Did he break up or did he stay with her? At one part, he said, "You make me happy." And he and was like, "And then end. another part, I heard him say, i 'I'm never gonna leave you.'" He said, "I think." I know that's so, what love man. does to you. It kind of messes your head up. And then at the end, he said, um, "What did he say? I got to get back to it or something." What did he say? He's calling me back. Yeah, that's it was that, like, that yeah. summertime was calling him, man. What I thought in the UK are so the, what is it? Winter time is like, the are the beaches good? You know, in the in the in, summer, in the UK. I mean, what's it like over there, man? Because I know over here, boy, you go down to Daytona, you go to Miami. We got some good beaches, you know. But out there, I don't know how their beaches are. I bet they're good. I mean, what's so good about the summertime over there? It yeah, must be well, like us. All right, well, we're gonna end it here. That was Led Zeppelin, babe. I'm gonna leave you. Tell us what to react to next off of the first album from them, and uh, yeah, then we're gonna move on to Led Zeppelin two. So yeah, we're going to see you guys in the next video, and we're out. Peace.